Gotcha. You're always sneaking up on me, aren't you? But I saw you this time. Well, hey, how you doing? Just give me a sec. Well, now, you did it, didn't you? You bought a big batch of ugly somewhere, didn't you? Probably chugged that yellow fluorescent green liquid called Dew of the Mountain. Sort of reminds me, I've never seen that color anywhere other than, well, you know. Never mind, never mind. Never mind that, my boy. Never mind. Well, more to the point, last time we spoke, last time you snuck into Art World, we were talking about this fine point that beauty adheres to truth. And, and certain natural laws. The first time I became aware of this was when I was picking wine berries out in the meadow. And I found that I could actually tell which berries would taste the best prior to, before eating them. How did I do this? It's very simple once you know how but almost mystical if you don't know how. Well, from experience, I knew that the most beautiful were also the most tasty. <clears throat> the most beautiful ones had an orange translucent quality. They looked like a little sparkling gem that you could see part way through, as most of them do. But what made the most tasty ones the most tasty was they were kind of peach colored, but on the outside they had this touch of red across the top of them. Kind of like the sun came down and kissed them. Different appearance. Not red all over, not orange all over, but orange with just that kiss of red. Perfect ripeness, perfect flavor. Very out in the sun to get more flavor, right? You know, you can do this with other fruits as well. Let me teach you. You go into the supermarket, you, you could, you're looking at cantaloupes. Cantaloupes can be amazing, but you have to find the right one. Now, if you pick up a cantaloupe and you see that it's mostly green rind or mostly just a dull brown, put it down. Try to find one that has an orange rind. It's got the little textures are going to be kind of tan, but the orange from inside the cantaloupe is coming through and making the cantaloupe more orange than anything else. And then you pick it up and you smell it. It should smell fragrant. It should smell sweet. If it does not, put it down. So in summary, Find one that has great color, the orange coming through, and one that has great smell. And then you know that you have an exceedingly good cantaloupe. That's how we do it here in Art World. We find the best to be the best.
You see how that works? I don't know about you, but um, I could go for a little cantaloupe, or a little watermelon, or just mm -mm, a little hunger. Yes. Do, do you have to be going? So, so where, where are you going? What? I'm, I was just getting started. I have much more to say about beauty and rules. No. Oh, in Greencastle, it's, it's lunchtime already? Is, isn't it a little early?